Ever heard the expression, nothing is really free? What have you given up for that free email? More than you realize. And it all revolves around the Constitution. Don't. Now you have a choice. We'll stand with you. 1791.com, uh, annual subscriber, now at theblaze.com. Could we play um, uh, Could we play the Chris Christie um, reform? Because I just, I, mm-hmm. I love this. Is he for gun control? Um, oh, no. No, no. Where would you? No. No, he's for violence control, Glenn. I just, I don't know where you're getting, you and your conspiracy theories. Do you still favor comprehensive immigration reform, including a path to citizenship? Well, Chris, what I favor is what I favor? a broken system. Oh, and, um, Isn't that the, everybody on the right side of the aisle who is for comprehensive immigration reform, that's what they say. Well, here's what I'm, I'm for. I'm for fixing a broken system. Well, that's what I'm for, too. Yeah, I'm I know. For, that's, that's why, why they say, say, that's it. say it. That's why, why, that's why they say, say it. it. I'm for breaking. You see, that's what progressives Who's do. Who's not for fixing a broken system? Progressives treat you like a moron. Yeah. They want you to hear the sound bite, and they believe that that's all Americans hear, and maybe they're right. And you I don't won't know. go any further and beyond that. And you won't go that. any further and beyond. I'm for, well, I'm for a broken system. Click. Yep. That's what I'm for, too. I'm for that. Click. Mm-hmm. We, we, we cannot deal with the complex, complex issues of our lifetime in sound bites. Hey, 2030, the singularity, there will be no death. Oh, I'm not for, uh, I, I'm for, you know, no death. Click. <laughs> well, wait, hold it just a second. What was the singularity thing? What was that? You cannot deal with the complex issues of our age in sound bites. But progressives want to treat you like a moron. Yep. Because they believe you're a moron. And so they will say, I'm for fixing a broken system or... I'm not for gun control. I'm I'm for uh, violence control. Yeah, that's coming. Oh, here. okay. Violence. The fact control. is that everybody knows the system is broken, and what Congress needs to do is get to work, working with each other and the president um, to fix a broken system that's mm. not serving our economy. Well, I'm well, for the Congress not our working together. Well. Yeah. You I'm, also course. support some gun controls. Why? Why? Well, listen. Chris, I think that, uh, you know, when you look at what we've done in New Jersey, um, we want to control violence. Oh. And uh, some of that may involve firearms, but a lot of it doesn't. In fact, uh, my focus has been on making sure that mental health mm. uh, is done in a much more aggressive way in New Jersey. Mm. Every mm-hmm. time we see one of these incidents happen across our country, it is almost exclusively with a deeply disturbed person uh, at the helm. And uh, what we need to do is be much more aggressive about how we deal with mental health issues in this country. So I'm for violence control. So I'm for violence 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 control. control. The Republicans think they're going to run him. I don't think the Republicans are going to run him. I don't think he'll run. I don't. Why? I think he has too many skeletons in the closet. I do. I think he has too many skeletons in the closet. So you think the Romney information will doom his, uh, his candidacy in 2016? The Romney information. What was the Romney? Yeah. Well, the Romney information was that he oh, had yeah. these. He had these yeah, problems. Yeah. I don't up. know about the Romney information, but I. I mean, I. I think I read a highlight. I don't know what that information was, but I think he does. Remember, we've been asking for a long time. Why is this? When we loved him, why? Why isn't the left attacking him? Yeah, it's because of this. Right. It's because He's a progressive. he is. He is a progressive, and they must have known I, it. All I, along. I have to tell you. I mean, again, everybody is looking at this all wrong. Things have already changed, but not enough people have caught up to it yet. By 2016, the whole world is different. The, the, the political mm-hmm. landscape is different by 2016. And, uh, and right now, people are saying, can we control the population? Can we just run enough ads? Can we just smear enough people? The answer is no. You cannot put the genie back in the bottle. It's out. It's over. So now you can either stand on principles and a big vision that actually revolves around the Constitution, or you will lose. You will lose. Because I really will not vote for another person. I will, Never before in my life have I said this. I just voted at a stupid local election. I mean, geez, for love, Pete, I vote. I ne- I will not vote for another Republican like Chris Christie or Mitt Romney. I will not vote. I will skip it. I will not 
cast my vote for that. I'm pulling the calendar out right now. Put it. And I'm going to put a 2016 you know date on the I reminder. want you to chastise me. <laughs> I want you to play this. Let me talk to future Glenn. Okay. Glenn, if you... Let me look right in the camera. Glenn, don't do it. Don't do it. They have fooled you again. They have played all those games again. And if you're thinking right now, well, but the other person... Doesn't matter. Stop selling your values out. Stop it right now. You play that for me if I change my mind in 2015. And you, I, I urge everyone in this audience, everyone in this audience, you remind him. If I start going down that road, you remind him and you chastise me. Don't do it. You're going to get... You're gonna well, get unless it's Hillary, you're saying, right? right, right unless right, it's Hillary, right. yeah, this, or if it's Biden, if it's or Biden, Biden, obviously, if it's Biden or Hillary, you got yeah. to, you've got we to, and it. you'll know that we deserve it. <laughs> if our choice is Chris Christie or Hillary, we deserve it. Yeah, we're we're going down the road to slavery, and we deserve it.